Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Is your Mac computer running slow? Your iMac or your MacBook or your MacBook Air is running slow? Then download this application. Google for Clean My Mac X. Just download the free download. You got a 30 day trial version of this application. This is a very powerful application, helps you in optimizing your system speeds, helps you in uh, clearing up the cache files of your uh, Mac and removing all the unwanted junk files as well of your computer and uh, it makes your uh, process easier helps you in finding duplicate files it also works as a malware protector as well checks your system security status and everything so once you install the application it's open up a screen like this and um, this helps you in optimizing the free space as we discussed then we've got a speed increase a protection system and updating your apps etc from this and um, this would be your interface so the first and easy way to do is to follow the quick smart scan it will automatically scan everything and uh, give you suggestions on what all to clean or if you wanted to go one by one or in a detail mode you can choose from the options on the left side we've got categorize them into different sections so now i'm checking the smart scan it first give me suggestions for cleanup like how much of storage can be restored um, with the cleanup procedure then it checks up my system for um, protection status if my PC is safe etc and it also gives me some suggestions for uh, speed optimizing like the applications which makes my PC run slow when I just go through this I'll be able to see the catch files are over 3 GB in size and um, I can just grant access to the system and I'll be able to remove or clear these um, log on cache files from here then on the speed I'm seeing some uh, options available to clean up my RAM and to run some maintenance scripts etc so if you want you can run them or you can go to individual categories and do whichever you need so now for the system cleanup it's asking me to give uh, access rights to my hard disk so uh, what I do is I just go to my system preferences and um, unlock uh, with your password and then log into the interface take click on the uh, plus sign at the bottom click on the plus and uh, search for your application uh, clean my Mac just open it it automatically gets added up you can choose the later option it lot still uh, make sure that the application gets updated close it you could see the full disk access has been granted now if you press scan you could see that uh, it automatically scans for your uh, system junk files alone and it gives me suggestions to remove them so I can review the details and choose whichever I have to remove instead of uh, following the smart scan and removing everything I can just remove from the applications which I don't need say for example some of you would be using your passwords and uh, logins etc in your Firefox browser so you can keep that intact and then do the others then if you have an iPhoto library you can control that if you have an email system then your iTunes if you have your uh, iTunes backup of your iPhones etc or if you are uploading or updating your OS it leaves a lot of attempt backup files you can uh, help in removing them as well then you've got other protections for malwares and privacy including your um, optimization speeds it shows you like uh, the apps which are opened up now for example Dropbox is like auto enabled I just removed Dropbox completely it automatically removes it from the system and you can just view the log of whatever has happened and you can see the list of other items which are making up your uh, max low you got some maintenance systems available as well the installer is a good one that helps you to uh, uninstall applications so this is the one to help you in um, checking up um, the storage size of different folders how much storage each of these folders take now the users folder takes about 54 GB of storage if I go into it I'll be able to see individually which applications take that much storage 
if you go into applications so it shows photoshop takes 2.4 gb of data so you can remove the unwanted applications which you don't use with just click off a button and then you can find out for uh, large files and old files it will give you links to files which are not opened up and the shredder is a cool feature available you can purge your files completely so that uh, it won't be recoverable from any recovering tools if you like this video do share it with your friends and thanks for watching